Hi folks, Lawrence Mann here and today I want to introduce you to the best budget tablet you're going to buy. And it comes with the Wacom Pro Pen 2, it has 8000 levels of pressure. Yeah, let's face it, you can buy a Wacom alternative with a Cintiq style screen but it's not going to have the levels of control that this has. It's absolutely brilliant. If you want a tablet that's going to help you actually become a better artist, this is it. Stay with me. <laughs> Okay, so here's the box. I absolutely love this as soon as I saw it. You know, great artwork on top. And this kind of gives you an idea of how different this tablet is to any other tablet out there. The Wacom Pro Pen 2, as I mentioned, this is an A4 size tablet. This is PC and Mac compatible. The artwork, again, I absolutely love this. And all those Wacom alternatives out there, they just come in brown cardboard boxes, which is kind of indicative of the level of thought that they put into it. This Here's the full size. I've also put the medium tablet there that you can go for, but I went for the large. The medium is kind of A5, but the large is A4. So here's everything you get for this. You're going to get the Intuos Pro itself. You're going to get the Pro Pen 2, which is absolutely brilliant. You're going to get the USB-C cable. You're going to get the instruction manual. And you're going to get the pen holder as well. So all of that is absolutely brilliant. And it's quite a small condensed package. What else do you need? The Intuos Pro is Bluetooth. So you don't need a charger. You don't need everything else. And it holds quite a lot of charge. It has eight express keys and that four function customizable touch ring. The active area on this, as I said, is A4, and there are the exact measurements. The USB-C cable is two meters long, and this has an on-off switch for the Bluetooth and basically for the tablet itself. This also has an on-off switch for the touch functionality, which is brilliant because sometimes you don't always want that. But the touch functionality works great to be basically like the touchpad on a laptop if you want to use it that way, which I do sometimes, which is absolutely brilliant if you're just using your screen and just browsing around on the internet. Here is the Pro Pen 2. Like I say, this has over 8,000 levels of pressure. It's really tilt sensitive. It's absolutely brilliant. It is the best pen on the market. This beats the... Apple Pencil, this beats the Microsoft Surface Pen, this beats everything. There is nothing better. Now here is the new pen holder. Wacom have never done anything this shape. It's really well built. It's built of metal. It's built of this kind of really soft material. It has 10 nibs in all. It's got soft tips. It's got hard tips. We'll take another look at these when we do the drawing test really nice. I really appreciate the new shape. I love everything about this. Yeah. The new cable is really appreciated and that's got a kind of a unique shape that fits really well with the with the Interest Pro. I, I'm really liking that. Instructions, pretty straightforward really. Yeah, nothing really, you know, to, to mention about that. Here, we've got the unique color touch rings. Before, they've always been the same color, but this time they are metallic. So that way you can personalize your Pro Pen 2. So if you're working in a studio and somebody else has a Pro Pen 2, you can say, I've got the red one and you've got the blue one. And that all works out really well. And yeah, it's just one of those nice little touches that you don't see from other companies. So yeah, I'm perfectly happy with that. So what else we've got? We've got this, which is a sample. Rough. Standard. And smooth. And that's the Intuos Pro texture replacement sheet that you can buy separately. And that gives you any one of those free textures, and that's absolutely brilliant. It extends the life of your Intuos Pro tablet. Right, onto the drawing test. As you can see, this gives you a more ergonomic kind of drawing pose. You're not looking down at a tablet, you're looking forwards at your screen, meaning you're not gonna get any kind of neck pains after even drawing for 12, 16, 18 hours at a time. 
a lot of professionals actually prefer this you know especially if you're working in a studio it's absolutely brilliant obviously like i've kept saying this comes with the pro pen 2 this is the best pen on the market i absolutely love this and even though i draw on a cintiq i felt straight at home with this because i've drawn with a wacom pen and wacom tablet since kind of the early to mid 90s this felt absolutely brilliant the 16 inch drawing space still felt great i wouldn't want to work with that size for say a cintiq but with an inch of us, felt brilliant. You can see some slight marks appearing here, but those just wiped straight off. I just felt so at home drawing on this tablet. Felt really comfortable, felt really great. This is one of the first pieces that I've drawn on this tablet. Just so great and so at home. The express keys working so well for me. I certainly think this is the best budget tablet that you can get, especially if you're not a professional artist working in a professional studio. Even if you are a professional artist working in a professional studio, I think this is one to consider. But if you don't want to spend those big, big bucks, you know, this is certainly one to consider because you're getting the best stylus on the market. So yeah, I mean, what else is there really to consider? I think this is one definitely to go for. Let me know your thoughts and comments below. What do you guys think? What tablets are you using? What's more important to you right now? Is it the pen? Is it the size of the tablet? Is it working directly on a screen? I'd love to hear. So let me know. I'll speak to you guys soon. Well, thanks for watching. Be sure to comment, like, and even subscribe to my channel, Lawrence Can Draw. And if you really did like what you saw here, you can see more of it on my website, lawrencemann.co.uk. I'll see you next time.